Good evening, or good day, everyone, and welcome back to the stream. Just yesterday, we did an extra stream to close off the main story of Super Mario 74, and that leaves a hole in our hearts for craziness, so... Uh, well, it's time to start our Pokémon randomized journey. I've picked Pokémon Fire Red because I'm fairly familiar with uh, the original Pokémon Red and Blue. So, this should be interesting. Um, this is the first time I've attempted to do a randomized game, so... Uh, <laughs> there may be some problems with the settings, who knows. I have tested it, so... Uh, I'm sure we'll be able to save. But I don't know if anything weird or broken is going to happen. So, this will be interesting. Also, hey Invader Tech, welcome to the stream. It was uh, your suggestion that led to this. So, should be interesting. Let's get the preparing screen out of the way, and here's uh, good old oak. Whoa. Let me make sure I can see both the game and the chat, that's always uh, an interesting challenge. Alright, so I have no clue what to expect. Uh, I have started the game once and just kind of uh, <laughs> typed my name in as ah, uh, just to see if I could save. Uh, I did see, I think the Pokemon that Professor Oak shows you is also random. Yeah, because that's Porygon, right? That's not supposed to be there, right? Or am I going crazy here? It's been uh, it's been a while, so please forgive me if I'm <laughs> uh, if I'm a bit dumb about the Pokemon types. Uh, sometimes I'm sure we'll manage. Porygon isn't supposed to be there, right? That makes sense. Ooh, the difficult question. All right, let's do my name as normal. And there we go. Yes, so it is. This is his grandson. Gary Oak. Um, well, I'm gonna call him Gary, but I don't want all the letters to be capitals, because that just looks like you're yelling it. But I'm fine with Gary right now. Dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Let's go. I do like how the uh, character, the complex or detailed portrait, kind of shrinks into this little budgy character. It's cute. I am played with the NES. Okay, it's time to go. We can't stay here forever. Hello, mother dear. It said so on TV, yes, indeed. Uh, I took until Gen 4 for them to stop it with the all caps uh, names, I see. <laughs> Yelling has only recently gone out of fashion, it would seem. Uh, this is not Oak's house. Okay, this is the right place to be. He may not look like much. Wow, throwing some shade there. All right, here's Gary Oak himself. Uh, it doesn't tell me which is which. I would have hoped to 
that we would get some time to think about it. Uh, let's see. I think I set it so that it is random, but it will pick a Pokemon that has three forms. Of course, O comes to warn us about the long grass, just like that scene in Jurassic Park 2. Alright. I'll be very disappointed if it's just uh, the basic three. No muted starter. No, I'm. Uh, I'm not sure if it was a good call to take out that part of the <laughs> potential craziness, but I wanted for the first experiment with randomized uh, Pokemon. I wanted something a bit. You know, it, it should be crazy, but crazy within limits. <laughs> if it turns out to be boring, we can always switch gears, after all. How did he come to lose all his Pokémon? Okay, so... Yeah, that's okay. It was just a test save. We can over. He probably released them all. Actually, that's probably true. Yes, okay. There we go. Whoa. Red text on screen. I see a Weedle. Uh, no, I do not. Nidoran, male. <laughs> Iggly buff. Well, I'm not too versed in the Pokemon tiers, but um, Nidoran seems like the better choice. Yeah, exactly. I agree. So let's do that. Let's go with Nidoran. Though Iglybuff would have been cute. Okay, cool. I wonder which one... Uh... Okay, so... Since you're the first person in the chat, Invader Tech, do you want a specific nickname for this Nidoran? I think it's fun to have people uh, pick nicknames. Also, hey Direct Flash, welcome to the stream. Uh, I'm not sure if Wigglytuff was in this uh, gen yet. Might have been. Don't have any nickname ideas. Then I'll just... Okay, how about this? What if I just call it, uh, Tech? Would you be okay with that? Let's see, it's capitalized in your name, so I'll also do it with capitals here. I'm not sure if the... the uh... <laughs> okay, I wonder if he's actually going to have Weedle or if he's just gonna have a normal starter now. Because I don't remember what it said in the settings about that. And he can have Iggly Buff. To take care of him in his old fading years. Okay. Okay, he has Weedle. I see. 
Oh, for Pete's sake, so pushy as always. Mount Zubat, yeah, I'm already scared. Yes, I think I understand this principle. You got a copy of Pokemon Moon? That's cool. Um, I thought about getting back into Pokemon uh, this generation due to the whole Alolan uh, thing with new variations of the Pokemon. It looked cool. You gonna do a Nuzlocke on it then? Will you be uh, streaming that or just doing it for your uh, for yourself? So they're both bows and Pokemon, so we're not gonna, yeah, we're not gonna do much in terms of stat sludge. I'm guessing smog is a stat uh, thing, so I'll just keep using poison tail. What? What was that? I'm not sure if it should have that move at this time. I don't even know what that is. Well, we are set to lose this one at this rate. Let's see, what did I do? Um, Alright, there we go. Uh, I randomized the moves, but within the type. So it should still make sense. That's what I meant when I said uh, I randomized, I wanted it to be crazy but within limits. <laughs> wow, Professor Oak has to pay his grandson. Smell you later. It's Delibird signature move, I see. Huh. Well, nothing we can do about losing that battle if he's gonna have that move on him. Although, Present has a random effect, right? It can also heal the other Pokemon, can't it? You wouldn't think. I, I specifically said that it should stay within the type, so it's strange that he got a move like that. It, Delibird is ice, right? Not uh, not poison, if I remember correctly. Oh, it's a normal type move. Alright, that makes sense. With a super random team, Direct Flash, do you have any specific Pokemon uh, in mind for that? Hmm. I'm guessing we can't get Pokeballs yet, so we just have to train our Nidoran for now. Okay, what's this? What is that? I don't know what this is. <laughs> I, I, I thought I knew the old Pokemon, but... Ah, right, it does have a random chance to heal the enemy, I see. It's a Gen 3 Pokemon, I see. Interesting. <laughs> it seems there are a lot of Pokemon I don't know about. I also don't know what Silver Wind is. Ah, that happens with Nuzlocke. Bad luck can really uh, get in your way with those. Oh, it's a fossil, that makes sense. I have played some of Gen 3, but not much. Not enough to find the fossils, I guess. Well, we're leveling up, at least. But that's kind of a dangerous kind of Pokémon to be running into, I think. You don't want to fight, do you?
Potion, very good. Gotta love this music. It's very nostalgic. <laughs> Another one of those. I wonder what other Pokemon are lurking around here. But at least the first area doesn't have a lot of Rattatas. Oh hey, we finally actually poisoned him. I, uh, or her, rather. I wasn't sure it was even possible. Did the randomizer let you have the national text right away? I'm afraid I'm not sure. There were a lot of settings that I probably don't understand the meaning of, I'm afraid. <laughs> Hashtag professionalism. Uh-oh, if this is a crit, we might go down. I think this is not a Nuzlocke. sure what we needed that little animation for, but that's fine. I might be saving <laughs> pretty often. You never know, after all. Oh, some Pokemon cannot be evolved until you have the national decks. I see. Well, we'll have to check how we uh, get that. Alright, Viridian City. I'm on the road to Viridian City. Hey, Slawik. Is that how I pronounce that? Slawik, welcome to the stream. Alright, we finally found the first Pokemon Center. You're from Germany, I see. Welcome to the stream. Oaks parcel, right. That's how we got the Pokeballs, right? Because we can't buy them right now. Oh, we can't even buy anything right now. How very typical. Route 1. Might as well fight a bit while we go there. Holy moly, what am I looking at here? Relicanth. Ah, that's definitely a fossil. Huh. <laughs> yeah, so you notice what I did make it do is be consistent with the types. So it makes sense for two fossils to pop up in one area because every area has its own uh, associated theme. Uh, Relicanth isn't a fossil. <laughs> Just by how it looks and its name, that's kind of what I would have assumed. I guess I'm not up to date on my Pokemon lore.
crab hammer. Well, that didn't do very much, fortunately. <laughs> it sounded kind of intimidating. Notification. Slavic 150 is now following. Thank you for the follow. It's much appreciated. Uh, which type? Uh, it's poison, I think. Unless you mean something else. Oh my, what is this? Cradily. I, I have seen this one, though. I know, I think I know about this one. Ah, nice. I was worried that I was gonna be very weak against all the types here, but it seems I can take this one on. Not sure how it fits with the other Pokémon here, though. Ow! But it failed. You can't do two sandstorms. One is bad enough. I was tempted to start uh, singing the root sandstorm there, but I decided not to. Oh no, I've actually said it so they keep the same uh, type for now, because otherwise it would get a bit too confusing for me. This is really my first uh, dip into the whole randomized principle, so that's why I've set, like, I've set certain limits to the craziness for now. Alright, I have received the Pokédex. Pokéballs! But I'm too old. So sad. What a troublemaker that Gary is. Oh me, oh my. So, do you have a map for me? Haha. Uh -huh. Right, now we have some Pokeballs, so we could catch us one of those uh, elusive Route 1 Pokemon. Right. What? <laughs> They're wrong. Oh, that's an interesting one to show up now. Oh, I didn't heal. Um, whoops. Well, I'm glad that missed. Oh, right, this one doesn't get poisoned. I'm guessing the catch rate isn't very high either. Could just toss a ball at it, I guess. You never know.
Well, so close, too. He just keeps missing me. Yeah, the catch rate is really bad on this one. Alright, this one is probably a better choice. Uh, <laughs> whoops. Man, that would have been awkward if this was a, a Nuzlocke. He would... You can only catch the first Pokemon you encounter in a route, so it's uh, bad news <laughs> if you happen to... Uh, KO them on accident. What? Soul Rock? There's, there are sure a lot of different Pokemon in this one area. Well, that was a bit awkward, but that's okay. Well, now that we're back up to full health, it should be easier to actually catch a few of these Pokémon. All right, it's this one again. Let's take care not to kill it instantly. Uh, maybe just a normal poison tail will suffice. Okay, that's fine. More sandstorms here. Alright, this one should work. Probably. Or not. Volt Tackle. Well, we are seeing some crazy things. We're gonna have to buy more Pokeballs at this rate. Why is the catch rate of all these Pokemon so low? Oh, this is the last one. No luck. Rock to hmm. And here I was thinking I could just pick up a few more Pokemon and fill up my team real quick. But no. <laughs> well, this one has to go down now. We might as well just train uh, our Nidoran first. Almost up to another level up. Hmm. What is the first gym again? Rock? Alright. Alright. 
Okay, now... Do we even have any money? We do. <laughs> See ya. I think we can get a bicycle later in this game. Would be nice to have that. Okay, let's see if we can actually catch one of these now. Come on. Oh, there's another one we haven't seen, Ammonite. But I know that one. Lord Helix, yes, praise Helix. Yep. Hydro Cannon. Man, these moves. So many fossils, all with their 6% catch rate. Yes. <laughs> hey, Clive, welcome to the stream. When I saw the starter Pokemon, I was a little worried this was gonna be boring, but... Well, we already run into so many crazy things at this point. Yeah, catching... Uh, actually, catching these Pokemon is a bit of uh, trouble. Um, the starters were Weedle, Nidoran, and Iglypuff? Is that what it's called? Oh, the frames. The frames. Um, are we still on? Is this still working? Uh, the frames went crazy for a bit there. But yeah, as uh, as Invader Tech says, the uh, stars were Weedle, Nidoran, and Iglybuff. I wasn't sure if it was Iglytuff, but... Okay, it's laggy. Uh, it should have recovered now. I always press A one too many times and uh... Yeah, Weedle. I should have gone with that one. A god tier Pokemon. Oh, well, there's this thing again. This is my face after I've just woken up. That's what it looks like. Well, it's poison, so its days are numbered now. Mist ball. Of course, his balls actually hit their mark, and mine don't. I need to be able to catch something. I can't do this with just Nidoran. Thank gosh. <laughs> <clears throat> right, that's Solrock. Um, our newest follower is Slavic, so I'll name Solrock after Slavic. Oh. Or not, apparently. Whoops. Sorry. Uh. 
Do we have... <laughs> I guess we can't nickname them here. Rip. That's typical. I keep switching the A and B around. Yes, that was uh, a quote I'll regret for many years to come. <laughs> anyway, let's have a look at Soul Rock. Uh... Rock Psychic. Mirror Coat Mist Ball. Huh. Well, the next Pokemon will be Slavic then. If I don't accidentally push the wrong button again, like I keep doing here. See if we can uh, find some more interesting Pokemon here. Maybe we should put Soul Rock first. Does it all, do, are all these Pokemon like including Soul Rock Pokemon with very low catch rates, or is Soul Rock a bit better? And is that why I got lucky? Oh hey, there's this monster again. They're about evenly matched, I think, these two. Every time I see announcements like the attack missed, I'm reminded of that super enthusiastic uh, Pokemon Stadium announcer. Saw Rock 6% too, I see, and I did get pretty lucky. Um, Pokemon City, I'm sure had a few good lines, the uh, narrator did at least. Well, narrator, whatever you want to call him. Rage is building, uh-oh. He's getting angry. Does this guy also have a very low catch rate? I would assume so. <laughs> it sure looks like it. My rage is building too. All right, there we go. All right, so. If I'm spelling your name correctly, Slavic. Slavic. There we go. Would have felt awkward if I <laughs> spent a long time not naming a Pokemon after you. T Twelve percent, I see. <laughs> By comparison, that is pretty easy. When I was a, a kid, I always played Pokemon like this. I would train only the one starter Pokemon, and the rest I would kind of just uh, occasionally involve in battle, but mostly to take hits for the starter. Because I was truly a cruel trainer. The lives of Pokemon meant nothing to me. 
I like how see ya is the response to would you like anything else. I would have said no thank you or something, not see ya. <laughs> Sounds kind of rude when you think about it. So, what do you guys think? Should I catch a few more or should I train these up and go for the gym? What is your opinion? I like how it shows the whole path. What if what if I was hiding the um, yeah, the uh, I mean the legitimate Game Boy Advance in a secret folder or something? In a classified NDA company folder. Route 22. Well, there should be other Pokemon here. Man, this music. Ah, right. This little funnel here. It's not, it's not a funnel at all. It doesn't even look like a funnel. It's more like a safety net. Oh, hey, there he is again. Oh, um, maybe I should have waited it out a bit. <laughs> Makuhita? Well, it should be weak against Psychic, but it's also gonna kill me instantly, you know? Clearly, training a bit more would have been the right option. Oh, I'm, I'm very glad he missed that one. Rip, yes. Well, Nidoran is picking up the slack. Or rather, Tech is picking up the slack. Haha! Weedle. Well, you know what we'll do? We'll do that old... No, you can't. We'll do that old trick where we bring out a weaker Pokémon. Uh, but if the battle... If this Pokémon is too hard to fight, we'll bring the other one back in. Level 9? How did you get it up to that level so quickly? I'm actually interested. Will he... Present? Oh. <laughs> He did this when we f uh, first fought Gary, his Weedle also used uh, Present, uh, which is why I lost. Because of that, yeah. Get out of here, Weedle. You worthless insect. Which of these moves is the best to replace here? My in my initial thought is that I should replace Rage, but I don't know if that's a terrible meta choice. I'm just gonna replace Rage. Now he can hit enemies with, uh, with his non-existent wings. <laughs> it seems like a move that belongs to Skarmory or something. Well, I can see Slavic has a lot of potential. Knock down that level 9 Weedle just like that. <laughs> I 
Let's head back to the uh, Pokemon Center for a little bit. I have no idea what caused this frame dip a little while ago. I think we've restabilized, but that was uh, strange. Right, so that is the path ahead. Oh, there's an old guy here who wants to teach you about how to catch. He teaches us how to catch Pokemon. Oh, man. I think I didn't take the randomized tutorial Pokemon. That's kind of a shame. It would have been funny if he... Called like a, a Mewtwo or something. What's the educate? Yeah, okay. The TGTV. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see. So, which is the right way to go? Okay, this is Route Two to Pewter City. Okay, that's where we actually need to go, right? Oh, right, the gym. Alright, this is actually the one we do last, right? The Viridian City one. Ah, well. Okay. Oh, you might as well check out some more Pokemon here. Oh, uh, hello, <laughs> ladybug person. Ouch. <laughs> that was a bit too strong, maybe. Another ladybug. Just trying to find a move that won't kill it instantly. Alright, that'll do. <laughs> you gotta love that effect when they're confused with the little, uh, the little rubber ducks. It hurt itself in its confusion. Yeah, you keep doing that. Wow, the accuracy on this move is so bad, I'm shocked <laughs> it worked even once. Alright, that's the last, uh, last one we can use. Ba-bam! Haha, <laughs> you got confused again. Alright, we can try to toss a ball at him now. 
or her rather. This is a, a female Lydian, Ladian. This looks like the kind of Pokemon that has earlier stages of evolution. Like this one is kind of like it has. It looks kind of powerful, though I was never very good at guessing that sort of thing. Well, we're gonna run out of money at this rate, so we'll just have to make do with the Pokémon we have. And what is with the catch rate on all these Pokémon? Can't we just have a good old, <laughs> easy-to-catch Pokémon these days? Well, we don't have many more chances to get this one. Okay, there we go. All right, um... And I'll call this one Raven after your nickname, Clive, if that's okay with you. I think it's fun to involve the, the people in the chat in the, uh, in the game a bit. Okay, and that gives us four Pokémon to work with. Let's uh, get them healed up and then let's see what we have. Okay, cool. Okay, nice. Well, now that we don't have much money, uh, we can't buy any more Pokeballs, which means we should just get some trainer battles in here. And also train our current Pokemon. And also, let's save regularly before I forget. Become uh, too used to relying on save states. I don't know much about many of these Pokemon. Jolly nature. Bug flying. Signal beam. Interesting. I will need to train all these Pokemon up a bit. Next down is Pewter City. We don't have a water or grass Pokemon uh, to combat that. Oh! Togetic! That's uh, an interesting thing to see. Needle arm? Oh, that's not very effective, fortunately. Um, the one thing I remember Togepi and Togetic having is Metronome, which is like a completely random move. And those can be a bit scary. <laughs> like, especially things are randomized. Uh, well, I think there have been Nuzlocks ruined by a Metronome that led to a self-destruct. Attack, huh? <laughs> if 
all the battles are gonna take this long, I may have to just switch to our strongest Pokemon whenever it gets a bit annoying. Oh. Um. Okay. Let's uh, switch that one out. Okay, that's better. Well, we might as well try to catch it now. Okay, I guess not then. There goes our last Pokeball. goes. The name Rager is all the way in Lavender Town, isn't he? I gotta love these little intro... Uh, illustrations. Hmm. Now I feel like I should have gone back to uh, heal my Pokemon up. Yeah, let's do that. Let's uh, once more, let's heal our Pokemon. Then try to stay out of battle. Fight a few trainers, earn a few pokey dollars or whatever they're called. <laughs> Poke money. Now, I don't know to what degree all the uh, trainers have been randomized here. Probably not too much. I think they still make sense within their area. Though I could be wrong. We're gonna find out. Oh, we could have just walked around, I guess. But I decided to play it risky. You know me, always living on the edge. Oh, we already talked to this fella over here. Exactly, exactly. I was hoping it would be a Pokeball, but... I guess not. Oh, hey! Beautifly. Good name. Very impressive. Raven can win this battle, but we want to hurry it along a bit, so let's bring Slavic in here and rock tomb the heck out of this butterfly. Yeah, this one ain't gonna do a darn thing anymore. Take this. 
Oh, Silver Wind. Is that effective against uh, my Pokemon? No, not particularly. There you go, get out of here. I like the big red X. Nice. Yeah, we want to look for trainers especially. There we go, finally a trainer battle. Hey, you have Pokemon. Come on. Let's battle them. Bugcatcher Rick would like to battle. B Bagan? I'm pretty sure that's random. Um, I can't tell what type this is just from looking at it. Oh, Sky Uppercut. Oh. Well, that wasn't very effective. You're going to hear me get surprised a lot. Wait, oh, ouch. That's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt a lot. We got lucky with that first attack, huh? Fortunately, that means the battle is ours for now. Nice. Haha. Drati- Wow. Really? <laughs> Dratini? Okay, if you say so. Bagon the Dragon, yeah. Wait a minute, is this a shiny Dratini? Or does it always have this color in this game? I don't remember the colors exactly. Needle arm. Get down. Very good. Player defeated Buckcatcher Rick. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I like that the dialogue didn't change there. I, th I think he's pretty bad at identifying his own Pokemon there. Raven can probably survive one or two more battles. Well, not not against a, a heat wave using Pokemon, but should be fine against. Uh... Yo, you can jam out. You can jam out if you're a Pokemon trainer, if you say so. Okay, I wonder what this guy has. Bugcatcher Doug would like to battle. Oh, that's actually a fairly normal Pokemon to have here. Of course, bug moves wouldn't be very effective. That's a poison type move? Yeah. Very unfortunate because it means uh, Raven isn't gonna be able to hold up in this battle. So we call on Soul Rock to be our rock here. So all Weedles, the moveset has generally changed for all Weedles then. Interesting. Psychic mm, is weak against Bug, isn't it? Oh no, it's actually super effective against literally everything. Bring it on, kid. Bring on that Weedle. Oh, ow. Oh. <laughs> I was afraid that was gonna hurt, but nope. You can't stop the rock. Can't stop the rock. Except when his PP runs out, then you can stop him pretty good. Okay. Another one down. Another one bites the dust. Kakuna, oh no. Hmm. 
I'm so scared. He's gonna he's gonna harden. Gonna waste everyone's time. Okay, I guess not. <laughs> no hardening here. You gotta love how much XP you get from evolved Pokémon, even the really worthless ones. Ancient power. He just learned it, but it's still ancient. I got 84 fun bucks to spend at the local... I was gonna make a joke, but I couldn't think of anything funny. At the local carnival, that's what I was gonna say, but I couldn't find the word. <laughs> okay then. Bug catcher Anthony would like to battle. Slugma. Okay, that's a bit scary for a Raven to be facing. Because, uh, well, you know, bug Pokemon and uh, fire. Alright, I think it's. Uh, Slavic needs more love. Wait a minute. That was a mistake, wasn't it? Isn't Slavic steel? Darn. Uh. Alright. Soul Rock, I think, should be able to manage it, though. It's not very effective, but it still did a lot of damage. Not a fan. Oh, this is a slightly concerning situation. He just spams heat wave at me. Oh. Well, we th that's just what we needed. Okay, there it goes. Okay, nice. All that leveling. Another one. Alright. This could be bad. Just saving up some money and now we're gonna lose it again. Okay, so long as we can hold out for a while. Outrage. Outrage, what is this, Twitter? Ah, darn. Hmm. Solrock has the best chance to survive, I think. Ancient power. <laughs> Why didn't I use that one from the start? Would have saved us some trouble. Nothing went right. You almost won, buddy. Hmm. Well, we are in a bit of a difficult situation here, aren't we? Because I need to heal, but...
Please, no, I'm gonna... Okay. Shouldn't have said anything. It's uh, Venom off. Maybe we can confuse it. Hmm. I guess not. Okay, we could just barely win this if he doesn't do anything weird in the meantime. Tail glow. Oh, it's a boost, okay. Well, I don't care, because you're going down now. Okay, very nice. Air cutter. I'm guessing this guy will fight us. Well, what have you got? Did you know that Pokemon evolve? Yes, I've been uh, informed of this. <laughs> Bugcatcher Charlie would like to battle. Sent out Ralts. That's a water Pokemon? That one becomes G Rallis, Ralts. That one becomes Guard of War, doesn't it? I recognize it by the uh, conspicuous red extrusion on its head. <laughs> that sounded way worse than I uh, meant it to sound. Hey, welcome back, Direct Flash. Oh right, the was my channel hard to find? Does it have like uh maybe the name is a bit confusing? Oh notification. Thank you for the follow, Direct Flash. Who should you pick as a starter? Uh what are your choices? Uh what are the options rather? Boom! This air cutter is really a game changer when we're gonna face uh, lots of grass and uh, bug related Pokemon. Rowlet, Litten, or Poplio? Uh, Rowlet is cute. But Litten is a close second. I would go for, uh, for Rowlet personally, but. Ooh, survived. Ow. It's kind of anticlimactic when it uh, does so many special effects and then ends up doing a few damage. What should you name it? Hmm. You could name it after yourself and call it Flash. Flash is a cool name. I got 84 bucks. Pay up, kid. You lost. Ah. Holy moly. Of all the things I was ex <laughs> Aryan, okay, that works. We have no more... Uh... Oh, dear. Wish. He wished upon a star. And it didn't do very much then. Mega horn. That sounds scary. As it turns out, it was pretty scary. Oh hey, the star. 
a wish came true. Alright, it's gonna be an uphill battle if we don't have a Pokemon that can resist his attacks. Uh, let's try it with Soul Rock. Wait a minute, what type is this? Okay, bad mistake, bad mistake. Oh man, I wish that attack had better accuracy. Is he gonna use that horn thing again? Please hit. <laughs> yeah, you can't make so many wishes. You only get three. Wish came true. Nothing happened. <laughs> kind of feels like a self-fulfilling prophecy when you wish for full health, but you already have it. Okay, that was an actual hit. The, the Rowlet is female, that's fine. I'm guessing this one is bugged something, but I'm not sure what. Uh, will Rock Tomb work? Yeah, I should have started with Rock Tomb. That's always effective. Just drop rocks on someone. No, don't wish. Can I, can I make a wish that it doesn't come true? Can I anti-wish that? Oh, come on. <laughs> Ar Aryani, that's that's fine. Oh, you would probably pronounce it as R Jenny in that case. Yeah. Jenny is a, is a is a female name, so he's just gotta keep wishing, isn't he? We've got this big intimidating bug guy with scissor hands, not the Edward kind. And he just keeps making wishes, he just keeps wishing on a star in battle. This is getting <laughs> kind of annoying real quick. If the attack wouldn't miss so often, this wouldn't be so so annoying, but Oh there we go. Not very effective, still goes down. Oh, well, that's immediately a bad start. Am I doing a Nuzlocke? No, not right now. Uh, it's something we could do in the future, but this is actually the first time I've done a Pokemon stream. So that's why I'm trying to uh, not get too crazy right away. So not yet, no, or I would have already lost at the very beginning. But it's definitely something uh, to think about for the future. It kind of depends on whether people like this. Uh, like the Pokemon streams. Okay, let's heal uh, Raven a little bit. Oh, whoops, I keep switching the uh, A and B buttons around. Like a silly goof. All right, there we go. Of course, <laughs> what's the hurry? 
Well, I was trying to avoid him, but... This could be the end. But catch a Sammy. Sunkern! Hmm. Okay, let's take it out. Please, no harsh attack. Okay, that was fortunate. And also, Sunkern is adorable. Look at those eyes. Okay, very nice. Can we not do an enc- Oh. <laughs> of course, last patch of grass. We run into a whoopee cushion with an eye. Not even gonna bother with that. Alright, we need cut to cut those down. Okay, let's head into town and heal our Pokemans. Okay. If you want a uh, direct flash, we'll name the next Pokemon we catch after you. You can, uh... Let's see what we run into on this route to Batch of Grass. After we buy some Pokeballs, of course. That's kind of an important part of the whole process of catching Pokemon. Uh, where's the Mart? Okay. We can buy four Pokeballs with the money we have right now. That's an unlucky number in Japan. But maybe it's a lucky number for us. Alright. Here it is. Oh. Wow. Articuno. Um, Air Cutter is flying, so it shouldn't hurt it much, should it? Okay, that was a very, very wrong assessment. Aerial Ace, that's a really powerful one, right? Yeah. Okay. The thing is, though, uh, we're not gonna catch this with four Pokeballs. At least the odds are very strongly against us in that regard. Yeah. We also need to take care not to use anything that will poison it. You'll be seriously amazed if you get this with a regular ball. Yeah, that would be special, to say the least. Aerial Ace. I don't remember. Can... can... Uh... Oh. I didn't mean to use this. Now you could... Uh, so, okay, so what I'm trying to ask is, what <laughs> what can I use against Arct Arctic Uno that won't kill it immediately? Ow! Oh, 
Oh wait, smog would poison it, right? It might be better not to do that then. Oh. Well. Our chances just got a lot worse. <laughs> Okay, that was stupid. But still, it, there should be multiple uh, ones there, right? <laughs> well, like I said, it's it would be nice to have Ar Articuno, but... The chances of actually getting that one with as few Pokeballs as we have, and the kind we have now, it's very likely not gonna happen, you know? Maybe I should have randomized the catch rates or something. <laughs> anyway, it is unfortunate, but yeah. Okay. Swallow. What is it <laughs> with wish? And what is it with the catch rates on all these Pokemon? Is it as a main move for all months? Hmm. Must be something weird that happened in the randomizing process. Are we seriously going to run out of Pokemon on a Swallow? Are we gonna run out of Pokeballs on a Swallow? See, I'm not I'm not sure how how I did it, but Okay, there we go. <laughs> bye bye, swallow. Oh, we have one more Pokeball to waste, I suppose. Who else is here? Pidgey! Come on now. We don't want your vanilla phase around here. Although, Pidgey would have been one I could probably actually catch. Guillotine! You're about to get your first encounter. Alright, good luck. Alright, this is the last Pokeball, so... Well, <laughs> that was pretty painless. Honestly, it would have been worse if it broke out at the very last moment, you know? It's probably better like this. When you really think about it. Well, we might as well do some... Uh raining here. I think I want all my Pokemon around or over level 10 to uh, 
to this gym, probably. I don't quite remember the, uh, the exact details of how strong Brock is, but... Alright. Have a missed ball. Goes down easy. Oh, hey! Pidgeotto! Arrow Blast. I don't think that'll do much to Soul Rock, though. Yeah, <laughs> one damage. Nice try, though. Oh, I picked the wrong move. Oh, hey! Another one of these. Considering it only has 5 PP, I'm guessing the Mist Ball is actually a pretty high tier psychic move. Anyway, <laughs> well, there's Gyarados. Guess you really run into another fully evolved Pokemon. Ah, Intimidate. Hydro pump. This could hurt. Alright, I'm not sure if ancient power is gonna do much. Alright, that's Gyarados down. Let's get Solrock up to level 10 and then... Uh... Oh hey! It's a Manta Ray. Mantine. But since it's female, wouldn't it be a woman time? Really makes you think. <laughs> All right, Direct Flash. Let me know if you uh, manage to catch it. Oh, there's this thing again, <laughs> Swallow. Oh, the theme of Soul Rock is very strong moves that have very little PP. Alright, that brings Soul Rock up to level 10. Very good. Exactly what we wanted. And now it's time for Slavic, who is a bit underleveled compared to the rest of the team. Let's see uh, what good moves are. Steel Wing seems to be fine against Pidgeotto, at least. But Pidgeotto isn't worth a lot of XP. <laughs> Nor is this little Pidgey.
you just imagine this creature waving its little arms as though they were wings? And making tornadoes from that? Truly majestic. A mental image that will haunt me forever. Doduo, I see. I once saw a really terrible, uh, terrible joke involving this one. I was, I was this close to just opening uh, a new tab in the browser and <laughs> looking it up to put it on stream, but you know what? Let's not. <laughs> uh, I can't describe it though, so I think it says something uh, except it's the evolved form of that one. And it says something like, besides three ha heads, the, uh, this creature also has three of other things. And then it shows the creature kind of <laughs> side-eyeing someone in a suggestive way. <laughs> it's so stupid. Wait a minute. Bubble? Uh, I think we can safely ignore Bubble here, right? These are all more appropriate moves for this Pokemon. Like, this could be situationally useful, but I don't think... Well, what do you guys say? Do I take it just for giggles and replace Rollout with it, or do I drop it? Your opinion uh, will be the deciding factor here. Because I think I would, on a normal run, drop it, but I'm not sure what you think is uh, fun or interesting to do. So, let me know. Vote now on your phones! Yeah, that is true. Okay, let's, yeah, and you know what, it would also help against Brock. So you know what? We're gonna do the terrible thing. Okay, this is interesting. Ah, Butterfree. I can't believe it's not Butterfree. It's fully evolved, so it should be worth some experience. Mega Horn. Gives us a mean pinch with his antennae. Yeah, nice. I don't know if I want to push him all the way up to level or... Wait a minute, this one is female, right? Yeah, I don't know if I want to push her up to level 10 all the way. But we'll at least... Uh... Yeah, I'll see how quickly it'll go. Maybe I'll at least go into level 8, maybe 9. Oh, hey Gyarados. Nice to casually walk into you on Route 2. Ouch. Yes, that's uh, painful. Oh, hey, the catch rate thing uh, works. Cool. Oh. Maybe I should have removed Slavic from battle there, but. Well, I guess it's up to Soul Rock to redeem this situation. Oh, there's no PP left for this move.
All right, let's uh, head into the gym and just see what'll what'll happen. So does the bot have a complete log of all the uh, Pokémon then? Hmm, let's see, how is this order? Yeah, we should let Sla uh, Slavic go first. Wait a minute, Slavic's holding something, right? Heartstone. Interesting. Okay, nice. Let's uh, go to the gym and see what's there. Let's go to the gym. Good advice for real life as well. But I never end up doing it. Pewter Museum of Science. Oh, we have to walk around? Okay then, Brock. Very funny. I bet he was having a laugh when he uh, put his gym here. Hiya, do you want to dream big? Do you dare to dream of becoming the Pokemon champ? I'm no trainer, but I can advise you on how to win. Let me take you to the top, yes. Alright. Let's get that happening. The first Pokemon out in a match is at the left of the Pokemon list. We're changing blah 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 blah. Yes. Near Brock. Winning trainers Gary, ah. Stop right there, kid. You're 10,000 light years from facing Brock. Camper Liam would like to battle. Beldum? That one looks scary and I'm not 100% sure what it is. I, w I thought it was something ghost-like so that's why I didn't use fighting, but... Yeah, it's psychic, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Okay, I guess this one only has side beam. In that case, why don't you have a taste of Mist Ball? Okay, I guess not then. This is maybe this one is Psychic Rock or something. It seems to have high defense. Uh, let me think. What's good against Psychic? The only thing good against Psychic is Bug, right? Okay, this is gonna hurt. But not as bad as I thought. Okay, so, signal beam. Okay, better. I'm guessing it's other- it's uh, vulnerable to this because it's psychic, but then that's cancelled out by its other type, so it's just normal damage. But normal damage is plenty. Magnemite. 
that's an electric steel type, isn't it? Uh, probably no point in using steel. Volt Tackle. Oh, ow! That was surprisingly uh, effective. Well, let's try Ancient Power. Doom Desire. Uh, you chose that as your destiny? That sounds weird. Anyway. I might not have what I need to uh, fight these guys effectively. Thunderbolt. Oh, ouch. See. Well, this is a bit awkward, isn't it? Raven is vulnerable to the electricity because she's a flying bug type. Oh, that's interesting. It doesn't affect him, okay. Okay. Okay, nothing affects this guy, I get it. <laughs> the problem is if I switch, what's gonna happen is I'm gonna switch to Raven. She's gonna take the Doom Desire attack and then a Thunderbolt in the face. And it'll be horrible for everyone involved. Oh, Vault Tackle, even better. Oh, but maybe the recoil will take him out. This might actually be a blessing in disguise. Yeah, nice. Wow, that was a bit tense. Light years isn't time, it measures distance. <laughs> Very true. Very true. I'm not sure what to make of that. Why is this camper calling me hot now? Anyway, let's heal our Pokémon before trying for uh, Brock here. Alright. I always look forward to facing the gym leaders because uh, the music <laughs> is good. Like every Pokemon game has a great gym leader battle theme. Uh, the original is one of my favorites as well as Ruby and Sapphire. Those are great. Anyway, let's have a shot at Brock Boy here. So, you're here. I'm Brock. I'm Pewter's gym leader. My rock-hard willpower is evident even in my Pokémon. My Pokémon are all rock-hard and have true grit determination. That's right. My Pokémon are all the rock type. Fwahaha! You're going to challenge me knowing that you'll lose? That's the trainer's honor that compels you to challenge me. Fine then. Show me your best. Mm -hmm. 
Leader Brock would like to battle. Aaron, ah, right. Super effective, but not very damaging. This will be interesting, won't it now? But Slavic is our uh, weakest Pokemon right now, so it'll be fine. Doom Desire. That's such a weird move. <laughs> Doom Desire and Wish. When you think about it, those two are really opposites, aren't they? Does this arrow not have attacks? Is it just gonna spam the same thing? Okay, bubble was clearly a good uh, a good investment here. <laughs> as weird as it is. Oh, ouch. That does a lot of damage, though. But it takes so many turns that it's kind of a moot point, really. Yeah, 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 yeah. I wonder what his other Pokémon will be. Because as you can see, it's kind of appropriate to his type, but different. Sandstorm Brood. Okay. Boom. Nice. Leveling up like crazy here. Oh, another one? It's fine by me. This one is a higher level. Wait a minute, would the dynamic, uh, would the punch actually be better? Hey, you have an attack, why didn't you use it? Oh, maybe the other one didn't have the attack, but this one does. Well, this is gonna be interesting from this point onwards. We could lose, but we could win. All I know is we've got some crazy Pokemon here. Ah, Psychic, yes. Mind over strength. <laughs> oh, it's not very effective. Well, there goes that. The attack missed. But the missed ball will not. Funnily enough. Okay, just gonna keep using those missed balls until they run out. This could have been a loss if he kept using the Iron Tail thing, but... Ooh, nice, a crit. Okay. Ouch. Is it always half your health or something? And there we go. 
Brock down. Nice. Player defeated leader Brock. Completely unnecessary uh, Pokemon scene there, but <laughs> I'm not even sure if you could hear that. I took it for granted and so I lost. As proof of your victory, I confer on you this the official Pokemon League Boulder Badge. <laughs> Drying pen. Okay, so you did hear it, fortunately. Arian received the Boulder Badge from Brock. Just having the Boulder Badge makes your Pokemon more powerful. It also enables the use of the move Flash outside of battle. Of course, the Pokémon must know the move Flash to use it. I got 1400 fun bucks for winning. Wait, take this with you. Received CM39. Yeah, 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 we know this. Alright, so that's one gym down. Without too much trouble. And now we have some money. We might actually be able to buy a few more of them Pokeballs. Let's heal first though. Yes indeed. Oh, there goes the bit rate again. Ah, uh, give me a second to recover this. Yeesh, you've done so well for such a long time, and now the internet just decides to screw up again. I finally decide. <laughs> To do a slightly longer stream, and there it goes. Maybe someone's messing with the uh, connection again. Uh, let me see if I can stop and then restart the stream. Recording is still going on though, so... For the brief moments that the stream isn't working, you and I... We are alone here. Child's ticket. A child. doesn't look like OBS is gonna stop streaming because for some reason it just outright refuses to stop. Oh, come on OBS, make yourself useful. Okay. Let's try that again. A 
space exhibit, I see. I was wondering what the rocket was for. <laughs> Looks like an ordinary rock to me. <laughs> so, can you see the stream again? Are we live once more? It should be, but... Uh, let me know in the chat if I uh, am in fact live and online and all that. <laughs> I've just been walking around until it f got fixed. Well, I was actively trying to fix it as well, of course. But... Hmm. No news from the chat yet. So either the chat window isn't working, or the stream hasn't returned, or... Perhaps people are simply ignoring the stream due to my sheer unprofessionalism. Oh, I'm online again. Okay. <laughs> That's good. Also, hello, Heath. Uh, should I call you by your real first name on stream? I always ask this of people who normally use nicknames. Because I don't want to just call people by name on stream without... Uh, Having the okay. You know how it is. So I should go to the left path now, I think. Now that we've uh, defeated Brock. Let's see. Hmm. If we're gonna go back on the road, we might as well take a few Pokeballs with us, right? He does sound better in English. That's true. I'll I'll stick with that then. Anyway, it feel uh, I was gonna stop at about two hours, but now that we've had such a uh, long downtime in the middle, it feels kind of wrong to stop it. Like I feel like people who stuck around need to be rewarded, so we're gonna continue for a little while. Maybe go until we get to the next town or something. All right. Let's get us those eight Pokeballs. Cha-ching. Is there anything else you can do? No. Alright, let's see what we'll run into on the road. To Cerulean. Okay, we've already checked this little patch of grass out. Right. I have mentioned this before, but I'm a bit directionally challenged. I don't always know where I am at a given time. Do I need to go back through the forest or something? Or is the path uh, right here? Yeah, I'm probably gonna have to go back through the forest, aren't I? Fun times. But we might find a cool Pokemon there, so it's fine. Just go right? Oh, okay, thanks for telling me, or I would have been running through the, through the forest now. Professor Oak's aid up and has to deliver this, so here you go. Running shoes, well, that's about time. Bye-bye. Okay, he moves out of the way as soon as we beat beaten Brock. Right. How nice. Oh, right. This is where we need to go. Okay, but... Oh, I love this music. I'm gonna say that a lot, by the way, because all of the music is good. Okay... Who is this? Excuse me, you looked at me, didn't you? Harassment! Les Janice would like to battle. Makuhita, huh?
Oh, present. Man, these are some weird moves. Meditite? Oh, I remember that one. I'm gonna be confused pretty often, but I do remember this one. This uh, garlic headed monk. Future sight. <laughs> but it failed. Well, that didn't help much, did it? Knowing the future doesn't mean you can prevent it, Meditite. I hope you learned something today. Iron defense, huh? I'll consider it, but I don't think I want it. Yeah, no. You can, you can get out of here. Alright, this will be interesting. I saw you in Viridian Forest, did you? Buck catcher, Colton. I don't think I met a Colton before. But I did see a Beldum. These one are these are a bit bothersome. Uh, maybe I should use bubbles since I have that <laughs> mysteriously. Oh, I recall what I did. I actually brought out Raven. Ah, darn. Confusion is gonna be a big issue. So let's bring out Raven and use that uh, that beam she has. Signal beam, that's the one. Red light, blue light. Okay, you're down, fortunately. Another one. Well, oh, fine. <laughs> I hope he doesn't have three Beldums, because that's, uh, it's gonna be bothersome. Beldumsome. That's that barely even constitutes as a pun. I could use a few more crits, really. And not against me, please. Oh, I shouldn't have said it. I shouldn't have said it. I jinxed myself. I knew it the moment I said we could use more crits. I knew it was gonna happen. I knew I had cursed myself. Condemned to myself. Another one, I see. You can probably get one more uh, signal beam off and then. I'll have to rely on not very effective attacks from here on out. Hmm. Well, Slavic, you're the lowest level Pokemon right now, so I'm gonna help you. Well, that doesn't help much, does it? <laughs> Dynamic Punch, let's try that. Ah, right, I remember why I stopped, because it's so, so inaccurate. Like, for a move with 5 PP, you want it to hit when you use it, you know? Okay, there we go. When it lands, it's darn good, but... Again? This guy is a liar. I never met no Colton. 
I would remember someone with a name like that. I was gonna make a crack open a cult on with the boys. Jo I was gonna make a joke like that, but it sounds kind of morbid. And I think we've learned since uh, Benjo Tui that we need to be careful of the meme frequency. At a certain point, memes can overwhelm the stream. We gotta, we gotta stay serious. This is a serious stream for serious people. Not really, though. Alright, what's next? Hey, kiddo. I like shorts! They are delightfully comfy and easy to wear. Youngster Ben would like to battle. No, you can stay, you can stay. Okay, bam. Down. Get get down, Geo dude. Like I said, dynamic punch is really good when it hits, but it's more like an if it hits, really. Heal bell. <laughs> Take a shot every time I say the name of a move, but with a question mark attached. Okay. Down and out. Larvitar. I don't know for sure what this even is. But it's dead now. <laughs> Youngster Ben has been defeated. I don't believe it. My shorts didn't help me win this battle. From now on, I'm wearing jeans exclusively. Shorts have betrayed me. Are you a trainer? Let's get with it right away. Uh, okay. Sounds a bit scary when you say that. Like that. Tyro... Okay, then. <laughs> Not very effective, still knocks down half his health. Crush Claw, huh? Uh, is Steel good against fighting? Mm. Well, we can't find out yet. This guy, uh, he looks like a chicken that lost its beak. Just look at that, look at that, uh, look at that head. Another one? Okay. I'm fine with that. Slavic needs more souls to consume. <laughs> Down. Does he seriously have four of the same one? I am not familiar with the meme you are referring to right now, Heath. <laughs> no, I am. <laughs> I I am familiar with it. But like I said, I gotta gotta keep the memes inside because once they flow out, there's no stopping them. But yes, for reference. Take a closer look at that snout! <sighs> there, I've said it. <laughs> we have reached the meme quota. Yeah, that's actually true if you had some more variation in your Pokemon, buddy. Hello there. Oh, 
also, this pose, like this, like, you're fa you're facing away from someone, but turning your torso back to them. What am I supposed to make of that, Sally? Oh, Diglett. They're cute. Bone meringue? Ow. Ow! Well, that was, uh, shocking. Well, air cutter should uh, help out. Yep, nice. She wants to make a lasting impression on me, indeed. <laughs> Good one. Ninkata. Oh, right. I know that one. Get out of here. She's an aspiring gymnast and wants to impress me with her flexibility. That might be it. <laughs> okay. Level 13 already. Be nice. <laughs> Buckcatcher James. Shadinja, oh. Um, how does that work? Uh, Shadinja always has one. How do I. Shadinja always has. Let's see. Oh, well. Yeah, right, right, exactly, exactly. It's it's invincible unless the uh, attack you use against it is uh, super effective. But... <laughs> it's gonna keep passing the baton between these two Shantinjas. Um... It's bug, right? Bug ghost, so fly should take it out, take it down. Ah, uh, don't. Okay, nice. Get out of here. Haha. -ha. Minimize. I'm glad I had a Pokemon with a proper type against this one. Imagine getting stuck in a situation where I couldn't catch a Pokemon uh, with a type move against this one. That would be awkward. I could probably, there are so many routes with so many Pokemon, so many TMs, so. Done like dinner. <laughs> good one, buddy, good one. Are you, uh... Oh, you are. Did you touch me? You walked up to me. Garvania? That looks like a very aggressive... Very aggressive animal. Ow. Let's see. Bite is dark, right? Ah, oh, nice. All of that XP. Let's see. Are we at the next town already? Rough skin. Oh, right. I 
I've seen other people play Pokemon and run into that, but... Anyway, now that we're here, we might as well try for a new Pokemon. Uh, I should... No. I should probably, uh... Put another Pokemon in front, though. Actually, Solrock might be better, because it's kind of tanky. Also, let's save. Okay, very good. Come on. Oh, nice! It's uh, Umbreon. Uh, that one is dark, right? Uh... <laughs> Payday. Very good. I don't know what move to use against uh, this one to prevent it from dying. Is dark weak against bug? Well, we'll have to find out. Yes, it is. <laughs> Whoops. Well, there we go. Oh, hey, what? Sneasel? Right, so... <laughs> Our Pokémon are a bit too good for this area. Holy smoly, what is that? Mr. Krabs. It's kind of scary, isn't it? But it has a star on its head, so that's fine. Let's try to catch it. Nice, we've got Crawdont. And, uh, hmm. Since you've just uh, joined the chat, Heath, the uh, Crawdont is gonna be named after you. Oh, alright. Uh, thanks for visiting the stream, Heath. It's much appreciated. And now you're part of my team, so even though you're leaving, you'll always be with us. Best of luck with the uh, cable management. Mm hmm. Good night. I tripped over a rocky, rocky Pokemon Geo dude. Huh. Yes, why don't you heal the Pokemon? All right. We're coming upon the two and a half hour uh, point, and I'm not sure uh, how to continue from here. Uh, we might catch a few more Pokemon, but then... Uh... Hmm. 
Is Sneasel worth catching? Looks kind of shady, if you ask me. Knock off. Well, we're not gonna catch him if we keep doing that. Well, now that our Pokémon are back up, we can uh, put a less dangerous Pokémon uh, at the forefront. is here. Oh, hey! Murkrow. Slightly low level for us, though. I don't think we want to actually get this one. Yeah, let's just knock that one out. Ah, uh, there's Crawdaunt again. Same level. That won't really help you, you know? Let's try poison. Yeah, that's what I should have done in the first place, huh? I hope this one takes it out. Okay, nice. You have defeated your equal and outgrown them. What a nice story. We could have a sneak peek at uh, Mount Zubat, as Invader Tech called it. Wait, is this is this the the, the place, or is that another? Mount Moon, right? Right. I'm so bad with names. Even though I played this game uh, to death way back in the day, it is Mount Moon. Well, we can always have a quick peek inside, can't we? Oh my, Breloom. Hmm. Oh, ow. <laughs> That's a painful way to start. Something that'll hurt it, but not kill it immediately. Yikes. <laughs> of course it had to be a crit. At least we aren't running into any Zubats. It would be typical if the only thing that stayed the same was the presence of Zubats, huh? Bullet Seed? Okay, then. Oh hey, it's it's Hitman Lee. I always thought it looked kind of scary. I always preferred Hitman Chen, because uh, well, just look at that head. Volt tackle. Okay then. That hurts. 
but not as much as I expected. Well, let's uh, catch this guy. Or try, at least. Almost had it. Revenge. Come on. It would be nice to close off the stream by filling out our team of Pokemon. Come on. Wait a minute. Is its, is its catch rate even lower than the... Uh, the other ones and the fossils submission oh this is <laughs> gonna be completely impossible then of course of course it had to get that close like I said I honestly <laughs> prefer it if it just jumps right back up the ball at least you know where you stand, then. But if it almost gets caught, but just barely not, well, that just sucks. That is a pain. Oh, Volt Tackle. Well, rest in peace, Nidoran. Oh. Well, there you go. Yeah, when it breaks out of the three shakes, that's true pain. Come on, I just want to catch one more Pokemon before we uh, call it a night. <laughs> GG, yeah. How's the uh, Nuzlocke going for you, Direct Flash? Okay, it's Machop. Gets much uglier every time it evolves. Jump kick, ow. Well, there goes Nidoran. Well, Slavic should be able. Oh, actually, no. Rock hurt. Uh, Rock is actually weak against fighting, isn't it? Oh well. This one should actually be possible to catch, but we don't have many Pokeballs left, so... It'll have to be this or the next, or it's done. Okay, we got him. Alright, then this one uh, will be called... Flash in your honor. Wait a minute, did I already call a Pokemon after you? Am I just... Is my short-term memory going? Let's see, so who's, what's our team like now? We've got Heath, Tax, Slavic, Raven, Slowrock and Flash. Truly a dream team. All oh, right, I'm gonna return to the Pokemon Center now. Man, this is the longest stream we've done in a while, and I don't regret it. This is very fun to start with something uh, new. I think monotony was setting in a bit for me with the last... Uh, like, platformers are great fun, but it was uh, it's also fun to switch gears every now and then. So, let's do the closing uh, song and dance. I want to thank everyone who visited the stream uh, today. It's really much appreciated. You guys made this first uh, Pokemon randomized stream into a really fun time. Uh, it's always hard to thank everyone individually, but thanks to Invader Tech, uh, Direct Flash, uh, Slavic, uh, to Clive, and to Heath, I think. Was that everyone? Did I miss anyone there? Anyway, thanks to uh, to all of you for visiting, and I hope to catch you next time. 
Um, Thursday is Pokemon Fire Red Day from uh, now on, but I may stream on other days as well. So if you want to be absolutely sure uh, to catch all streams, it's good to follow. Uh, or you can just always check back on Thursday evenings Amsterdam time. Uh, no, I don't have a PS4, unfortunately. Just, uh, just Nintendo consoles and PC. Uh, my, I think someone in my family has a PS4, though, so there's probably one somewhere in this house. <laughs> only now do we have an extra entry in our Pokedex, because all these other Pokémon belong only in the national decks. Uh, I probably won't need it. But I'm still gonna make a safe state, just because. You never know. And because I am the paranoid person that I am, I'll also make one more, uh, one more save. Anyway, so there you have it. Uh, we will certainly stream again uh, Thursday next week, but there may be other streams in the meantime. And on Tuesday, which is our other streaming day, we're either gonna play one of our chill games like Super Mario All-Stars or Mario Golf or perhaps pick up an all-new uh, ROM hack for uh, the N64. Who knows? It's all uh, very exciting so I hope you'll join me next time. But until then, uh, that has been the stream. So, thank you and bye-bye. <laughs>